Yo guys, what's going on? It's your boy Beansy. We're here today with a brand new upload. It's amazing that Gears of War is finally releasing some new content for us. You know, we're literally two weeks before the game and they are dropping trailers like no tomorrow. They are dropping like I drop people online. Crazy. Feed after feed. But guys, they've re just released the Horde trailer. And as you know, guys, I like playing Horde. I'm I'm quite partial to the older Horde game. <coughs> no speed runs. But, um, you know, I'm, I'm partial to it. Um, I do enjoy Horde, I do enjoy that whole survival element, you know, it's been my background of gaming for quite a while. So let's just jump into this trailer. If I pause it along the way, you know, let's do some breakdowns, um, let's see how I feel about certain things that I see in this trailer. Um, and see, I just want to know why they've put it in. So, guys, let's just jump into this trailer. Exclusive. Whoa, hi Guardian. You must be a boss. Wow, they came out quick. Okay, juvies. Power. Power still available. Right, let's do this. Horde. This is your last chance. Teams of five. I'm still seeing teams of five. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, yeah, still seeing five. Airstrike ability. Okay. X-ray. Faz. Through the wall. Okay, I'm just going to pause it right there. Cloak. Right. So the first thing that I've just picked up on, like, straight away, is from Gears of War 4, they've taken the new cards that they released right at the end, which I believe were actually X-Ray, Cloak itself. No one actually used these as cards. Like, no one bothered to use these. Out of all the Horde games that I've played, and believe me, I've played about 72 days of Horde, no one used those cards. At all. So I'm assuming that these are now... Oh, excuse me. That's the Rockstar gas coming through right now. Mm. Battery acid on point. But they they must have released these as abilities. These have to be abilities. So we've got Cloak, X-Ray, Airstrike with JD. Let's just let's keep going. I like that though. Graphics insane. That's what I like. Jack, hijack. So he controls over other enemies. Okay. Okay. Help me secure the desk. Ooh. So. Second thing I've just seen. That was a weapons locker. However, that weapons locker spawned already with heavy weapons on. And there was something called the desk. So I reckon... You move your way through the map, potentially, to secure a desk which unloads a load of weapons. Potential, because all I've seen on that was a load of tri shots, heavy related weapons, salvos. Um, that's quite interesting. That's quite interesting. But we have seen in that trailer then, Faz was hid behind the fabricator. So there's still the fabricator. So are we still getting classes? Are we still getting classes or are we still just running on abilities that we've seen so far? That looked like a sniper strike. That, wow, wow, wow. That then, Jack was like projecting a yellow overshield on top of Marcus right then. That was a yellow overshield. I wonder if I just reverse back. Right, here we go. So there's the desk. Still engineer type class coming through. But it's just this I want to see right now. That is a yellow overshield. So if you can play as Jack, you're t potentially a class I've always wanted to play, which was a medic. I feel they should have had a medic in Horde mode. But that's that's insane. That's like Apex Legend, you know what I mean? And I reckon if you're levelling up you know, characters, I reckon you'll start with like a green shield, blue shield, purple shield, yellow shield for max out. Potential. Potential. Who knows? It depends how it is. But what I've read up on Horde is you have to level up your character that you play as for your abilities and your perks to get stronger. Could be a potential. Could be a potential. Let's just keep it rolling. Good to see the Berserker coming back, though. Outnumbered. Outgunned. Marks her. Mmm. Overrun. Oh, shit. Wow. Boss waves. Good to see the same enemies. What was that? What was that? This thing here. What is this? This like slug little leech thing. What? What? Berserkers though. Wow. 
Halo Reach character packs. I'm quite alright. I'm quite alright. So there we go, guys. That is the trailer that we have right now. I'm just going to run it through so I can just do a little bit of, like, you know, a little bit of talking whilst it's going on in the background. So obviously there's bosses. Obviously Jack can hijack. He's not going to be able to hijack bosses. Let's be real. That would be stupid. Jack being able to hijack a brew mark. No. Not happening. But that's an amazing feature, you know. It's good to see that we still got all the fortifications going on through the video. So I'm, I can see we still maybe have classes, you know, with the sniper, engineer... Obviously, now you hear on the screen behind me, you know, there is ability. So, JD's got airstrike, x-ray, cloak, hijack. Quite, quite intense, you know. That's quite unique, but will it be a card? It depends what other cards you've got, you know what I mean? Whilst playing Horde. But the, the ability to play as Jack. Maybe he's a card. So, I mean, so he's in charge of that tracker then. That was blown up. You see what I mean? In, in this trailer, it doesn't look like we're on defending. It's more like we're attacking. But it's good to see the Berserker. I'm... Damn. It's great to see all these bosses come back. That was multiple Snatchers right then. That was multiple. We've got the Badass Berserker back in this. We've got the Swarmak. It seems a lot of chaos. A lot of chaos. And I like that. I like that, guys. Well, this being your boy Beans, I hope you've enjoyed the, the video and my views on it. You guys take it easy. I'm out.